Hey everybody, here we are for round one. We're playing second and we got a one lander. We got a one lander. Mulligan. What do we get? We get a two lander with a magma spray. <laughs> I guess I'll keep that. Hope there's something on top. Swamp? I guess we need to land and having something of a, a different color will be helpful? Question mark. Red. We're always against red. Pass the turn. Give me a Neff cry. Hey, hey, mirror match. Good old mirror match. Uh, you don't need a 2 2. Pass the turn. Grasping dunes. Cursed Minotaur, that probably would have been a better Magma Spray target. Uh, let's drop a Battlefield Scavenger. So I'd kind of like to get this Brute Strength in the graveyard before I drop the Javelinier so that the Javelinier kills the Minotaur. I could always exert, throw this away, draw a card, drop the Warfire. Let's see what he drops here. Edifice. Ew. Um. Yeah, let's do what I said there. Attack in, exert, throw away the brute strength, turn it into a different card. Oh, right, he had a mana up. What the hell am I thinking? What the hell am I thinking here? I... gross. I guess I'll just... Ugh. I guess I'll pass the turn. Edifice! Such a good card. Won't be sad seeing those go away when Hour of Devastation comes out. An uncommon going down to uh, a single pack in the draft. Won't be seeing them too much. Electrify, well that's a thing. Tap my dude. Can I take another three? I'll take another three, electrify what he plays, drop Warfire to kill the Minotaur. Cycle of Wander and Death, sure. Take three. Please play a creature with four power or less. Please don't just pass the turn. Thank you. Zap. Edifice, my dude. Zap. And pass the turn. Grim Strider as a 3-3. Three, three. Pretty good. Pretty good. Welp. How about we drop the True Heart Twins? Edifice a dude. Pass the turn. Won't play that land so that I have something to throw away if I exert uh, with Battlefield Scavenger. Uh, 
give everything plus two plus oh. It's fourteen damage. Seventeen damage with a brute strength. Not bad. Uh, but he's gonna start edificing my true heart twins. Hey, sweltering sons, how's it going? Well, let's drop a bat. Let's see what he hits. True heart, sure. I will go in exert in plus two plus O, oh, and I'll throw away a mountain, turn it into something else, and then we've got a brute strength up. What do we smell? Do we smell an electrify? <coughs> electrify, kill, make a 3-3, three, three, eat, or actually trade. And if he does try to electrify, we actually get to save this with a brute strength. Splendid agony. Counter, counter. Um... That's fine. That's fine. We're still going to eat your Grimstrider. <coughs> I would like to do that. Throw away a mountain. Draw a mountain. Sweet! Look at me go! Block. Brute strength. Kill your dude. Trample over a bit. Pass the turn. <coughs> That edifice, though, that's going to be the end of us, but it's going to take a long time. Man, how good would Harsh Mentor have been in my deck, eh? It would have been pretty good. It's going to get Grim Strider back. Sure. Ugh. I do enjoy that even playing 16 lands, I still flood out like crazy. Can't attack, sure thing. Warfire Javelinier in. I feel like our deck is definitely going to run into the issue of just not having bombs. We just can't compete with the average league deck. Emberhorn Minotaur. Attack! Ooh, you're letting me attack. But why? Why can't I exert with that? There we go. I guess you're going to double block my true heart twins? Yeah, in for two. In for two. Uh, sweltering suns, kill your dudes. And my dude. But your dudes, most importantly. And drop an Emberhorn Minotaur. Alright, deck. Nothing but gas on top. Nothing but gas. Give me Trial of Ambition followed by Cartouche, Cartouche, Cartouche. Opponent passing the turn. I don't like the smell of that. Don't like the smell of that one bit. Emberhorn or True Heart? True Heart? Sure. Emberhorn in for five. Or in for four. If you're not presenting a blocker, I'm not going to waste an exert. What do you got? Electrify? Final reward. All right. Didn't matter what I did. All right, deck. No more lands.
No more. Liliana's mastery. Sure. Can I have my sweltering sons back? Thresher lizard. Make my dude unable to do anything. <clears throat> Boy, had we have drawn, you know, three less lands, we would have been in good shape. What you got? Another one. Holy moly. No attack. Sounds good. Go to combat. True Heart Twins can't attack. Sure thing. In. Probably just takes it. Supernatural Stamina. Dead Zambi. Pass the turn. So, discard, discard, I take seven. Discard, discard, I take seven. Opponent has the game. Doesn't even have to, he doesn't even have to do that. He can just be discard, attack for seven. Pacify. Pacify on his turn, discard once, attack for seven. Sure. It's probably my biggest fault. I think, well, I'm not going to get into that, um, what my biggest fault is. It's a fault I have with the format, and uh, really formats for the past year of Magic Limited, is that if you draw two lands too many, or two lands too few, sometimes even one land too many or one land too few, you just lose. And I don't like formats like that. I like formats where you have stuff to do with your mana if you draw too much. And, you know, if you draw too little, you're not instantly dead in a turn. I just want slow magic to come back. I want Battle for Zendikar. I want Shadows. I want Innistrad. I want Return to Ravnica. Good old days, not this stuff. All right. Play first. What do we get? We get spells, lands. Prefer a two drop, but we don't have one, but I'll keep. Let's drop a mountain, make him super duper afraid of a magma spray. Ooh, fancy. Trial of Ambition. Uh, so I guess we'll probably go with Thresher Lizard here. We'll see what he plays for two. Battlefield Scavenger. Um, do we just want that to die? Um, now yeah, let's drop a Thresher Lizard for now. Next turn we'll give him a choice of what dies. Hit me for two and exert sure what hand did you keep opponent and can we take advantage of it cursed minotaur sure Well, kill something. Probably that, I would assume. And I'm going to bet you don't want to trade. And I'm not going to block. Well, I can't block, so in we go. I take three. 
Hmm. Opponent doesn't appear to have been hurting for lands. Why throw away a final reward? So very weird. Okay, deck. Ha ha ha. I complained about drawing too many lands. Super funny jokes. In for three. You take it. Let's drop a sure shot. Pass the turn. Yeah, this is just a deck from, like, a better pod. <laughs> a pod that just had so much better black and red spells than our pod ever had. Double Merciless Javelineers, Final Rewards. Didn't see any of those. Starting to see a lot of uh, distaste for leagues online which I'm happy to see because I think Wizards definitely fucked up by uh, taking away cues. And I'd like to see them come back. Not replacing leagues. I think leagues have every right to exist. I just don't really want to play them for certain formats like this where... There's such a, uh, a variety of good cards that will demolish you. You're going to do that? Uh, I guess I save it. Doesn't feel great. What you doing? Coming in? Um, so I could block block, they could discard, discard. You know what? If you want to throw away a whole grape wig bunch of cards to kill off a 2 3 and a 2 2, be my guest. Come on, fourth land. One more land. We've got removal, removal. Good creature. We got stuff. Uh, splendid agony. Okay. Sure. So I used one card, not two cards. There's a land. Um, I'm going to come in for three. And I think you're going to take it. Yeah, you are. And then we're going to drop our friend Emberhorn. Just give me a cartouche on top. Just give me a cartouche. Strongly debating just not speaking for the rest of this video. <laughs> just in pure protest of this format. So I guess we have to kill the Javelineer this turn. Otherwise we just die next turn. I've had some people try to tell me this isn't a bomb because the removal kills it. No. It is a pure definition of a bomb, a bomb that arguably should be mythic. I don't give a damn if removal can kill it when it has haste, has such a huge impact on the board, and you have to have the removal in hand ready to go and be able to use it. 
for it to actually just ugh, not gonna get into that sick and tired of people trying to tell me stuff like glory bringers not a bomb <laughs> uh. so yay we had removal and we killed glory bringer that doesn't change the board state after getting hit with hasty four in the air and killing my best creature. So we got to trade here and go to one. And then what? And then what? Manticore? Grimstrider. Sure, so I need two creatures, or I'm dead. <sighs> sure, cool. Cool beans, cool beans, cool beans, cool beans. I don't care. Uh, yeah, that sucked. That sucked a lot. That was just such a prime example of why I hate leagues. That deck came from a pool where cards did not exist in our pool. Those cards did not exist in our pool. That deck would have been 100% impossible to build in our pool, especially with me being in black-red. And so the opponent just basically gets a free win. Uh, yeah, if you're tired of leagues, don't just complain. You know, I'm not just complaining here. I make sure that I let MTG Lee uh, know. I make sure that I let the MTGO people know that I don't like having leagues as the only option because they're significant significant problems with them so if you agree definitely make your voice be heard i'll see you guys for round one or round two where we uh maybe won't play red we'll see